welcome so today yes I made for you this fabulous look all right so um, this look is a concrete situation yes I paired it up with my lashes from Huda Beauty in the style Naomi and I handle it all complete with this um, lip situation of course a flat out note would do you right this look would be perfect for a convocation ceremony matriculation prom and you will definitely be the star of that event don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe to this channel drop your questions comments and the request in the comment section if you want to see how I get all of this done to stay tuned hello welcome so yes I am starting off this makeup look yeah you guessed it with the brows you've already seen how I do my brows but if you still need an in-depth um, analysis into how I do my brows do check in the description box other than that let's get on ahead with the rest of the makeup look now my brows are complete we shall go into the lid all right come with me time for the eyes okay let's start with the eye primer and i'm using this primer from classic cosmetics this is a brush i love to use to apply my eyeshadow primer well i want a very light layer on the face because i don't want to stress myself to blend because the more product you have the more time you take to blend wow just so that i'm fast with my blending let me use my finger to blend the blending is complete all right to my crease color now well because of the look i have in mind let me start with this shade it's an orange shade okay this is the margaret echo palette from by house of tara okay i'm gonna apply that shade with this brush okay that's this shade here this color is a little too light on my skin so I'm gonna not go too far oh. actually no I'm not supposed to come too far down intensify that crease color a bit I'm gonna apply this red shade yeah this red shade on a different brush here so this brush I will be light handed with it red can mess me up I'll start little by little and build up this. see where it says going so I will go back in with this brush and that same shade so that I can blend in the crease color nicely all right i'm going in with this yellow shade this one on a different brush okay with over the orange shade so the interesting part i want to cut my lid all right i will use that um, same eyeshadow primer from classic that i showed us before to cut my lid the Queen Nana palette I will apply this shade apply the red then the orange and the yellow just like I did on the crease then I'm applying the red now now to the orange shade I'll just go over here. Oops. Then use it to blend this part. Time for eyeliner. You know how I do it. So this is the eyeliner for today. And this is from Karak Beauty. It's ultra and um, waterproof liner. Alright. So because my lashes are coily, I'm gonna have to brush down the brow hair 
well, 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 I just lost audio on um, this part of the clip, so let's rock and roll. Now I'm gonna um, hydrate my skin with MAC Prep and Set, and that's the MAC Fix Plus all over the skin, yes. Give me some moisture. Now to MAC Serum, all right? I am um, still applying those on my face to prep the skin, all right? Then off those earrings. And um, to my, oh, what do you call this? To my HD Primer by Laura Clean, all over my face to prep the skin for foundation. Now to foundation, Mary Kay foundation in bronze 600. And I'll be applying my foundation with the brush and the booty blender. you blend um, around the face like around the edges of the face and then um, yeah all over just to make it look very similar <laughs> concealer time I'm putting it underneath my eyes my forehead down the bridge of my nose and on my chin this is where I need to highlight and bring emphasis to it. Then for contour, I'll be using my um, Black Opal Stick Foundation in Ebony Brow. Only con I'll have with this product is that it transfers. Other than that, it's a lovely product. Underneath my cheekbone, um, the sides of the face, as you can see there, um, the bridge of the nose for that um, nose contour. And I'll have to blend this in with my delicious blender. I love the booty blender. <laughs> I just love to call it bootylicious blender. Okay, bounce it all the way and bounce it all the way to friends. All right, for that complete three dimensional look. setting the concealer all right i will use my sasha buttercup setting powder okay i'm going to apply very minimal amount on my forehead because sometimes i really don't understand my forehead blend it doesn't blend the way i like so i'm going to make it very sparing the amount of setting powder that i'll apply i think the blend now looks cute right yeah to the tip of my nose and the bridge of my nose actually I want a very little amount as well so that the contour shade will be pronounced so time to blend the contour I'm using my Milani pressed powder all right in earth glue I'll just dab it press it into my skin powder using the powder brush from Zaran Cosmetics and this brush is good I love this brush and I highly recommend it such um what does it say Sasha well Zaran products brush wise they are really okay I'm watching chopped on TV <laughs> but the volume is up blush I'm gonna make my blush very light and I will not take it too far up because I'm really bothered about the scarring on my face the blemishes so I'm not gonna be too high up with it and I'm using um, this powder no this palette by Morphe well let's do this straight the shade is so light, I like the shade. Well, back to my eyes now. Let me go underneath my lower lash line. The shade that I applied on the crease. This is the red, red shade now. Now I'll go in with the orange shade that I used earlier. This is the shade here from the Margaret Echo palette by House of Tara. Okay. 
the next shade which is this one okay this is the Margaret Echo palette so still on the same brush but the brush is too big so if you have a smaller one it will be perfect but I'm gonna manage this I want to do some black liner people time for mascara you guessed it guys so let me go to my lower lashes now mascara when I'm done with that I apply first lashes I do I apply my mascara I I dance around with that I wiggle and drop down I wiggle then I stretch it down I wiggle at the root then what's this time for false lashes I'm true with the eyelashes all right this is the Naomi style lashes from Huda Beauty okay now to the lips but I just want to let you know yes indeed it's true why you're not what you're seeing my um, setting powder I reapplied it just on this part I kind of like that look and that effect that it gives I might wipe it off if I'm thinking that it's too still too harsh when I'm done with the entire makeup look I'm almost true so now time for the lips well all I want to do is apply this shade well I just checked through the labeling it's saying that this is a lip oil but mind you uh, sorry it's calling this a lip gloss so this lip gloss is what I'm gonna apply it's a matte lip gloss okay it's a matte lip gloss so I just like the shade I don't want much color on my lips all right I don't want much color all over I'm not using any pencil okay actually my lips tickle <laughs> my lips um, this is my matte lip gloss now with a nude lip and this is from black just on the center a quick lip oil <laughs> that's my face yes I'm back with my my fix plus yes I'm gonna set this makeup I'm using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit Highlighter in the shade Golden Bronze, alright? I'm using a small brush to apply. Once, whoops, what's this? Oh, it's a large glue. apply inner corner highlight I'll be taking this white shade okay and that shade is called Sun Bust this look is complete So give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it subscribe to this channel don't forget to share with your friends and um, drop your feedback questions comments in the comment section we'll love to hear from you if you have for anything you get um inspired do well to tag us on all social media platform we have Madiba concept on Instagram Facebook Twitter we'd love to see your recreation of course we hope to inspire you we hope to see you on the next one. For now, bye!